going on, Blood Squad? It's your girl, Chloe Yasmin, back in the cut with another video. Do not mind the background. We hang dry all of our clothing, so got the rack in the back, but... Nobody cares about the rack in the back. People care about the sound of the food being cooked in the background. Girl, get the heck out of here. I like my outfit. I bought this jacket in my recent video, and it matches the pants that I already got from Zoomies. You know, I really like Zoomies as a store. I feel like they have some really cold clothing, but the music that they be playing in there is so raunchy. I'll be like, um, that was a lie. Let me get the heck out of here. Let me get what I gotta get and go. So before I go ahead and hop into today's video and start vlogging and going about my day, I'm about to go ahead and show you guys some of the stuff that I got in my P.O. Box. I actually just went to my P.O. Box. My brother should be pulling up soon because me and him are going to be going to Best Buy soon. So so anyway, I have like a good amount of packages here, so I want to go ahead and share them on camera before I go ahead and hop into the video. If you hear any sizzling in the background, my mom is cooking, so please do not mind that. I, I, I honestly wish I could have like a soundproof type of thing going on. Wait up, wait up, wait up. Do y'all like my little press-ons? They're really cute. I kind of like them. So the first package is from Kim Woolley. Okay, girl, thank you. I'm super excited. Ooh, what is this? Dry conditioner? I've never, honestly, I think I might have heard of dry conditioner, but I've always heard of dry shampoo. Okay, sis. Okay. Thank you so much. See, I love when y'all introduce me to new products. Like, come through, Kim. Thank you so much. Wait a minute. There was a letter in here. Oh my gosh, what's wrong with me? I seriously love when you guys send me pictures of yourself. Literally, like, looking at family. I love that at the end of her letter, she says, by the way, take a break anytime. We understand. Life can be hard. So, basically, this and there's another product in here are her favorite products. And her and her 13-year-old daughter watch my channel. And you guys are literally so beautiful. It's crazy. And it's crazy how much she looks like her mom. You guys look amazing. Skin is popping. Okay. Setting spray. Slay all day setting spray. Spray before and after your makeup application. Okay, so I don't wear makeup. I'm pretty sure there's not a rule against using it if you don't wear makeup. Okay. So thank you so much. Slay all day setting spray and then dry conditioner. Thank you so much. Gavin Curtis. Okay. Well, this is a cute box. Okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Look at all these chocolates. Oh crap. Dairy milk. They have mint crisp, fruit and nut, golden crisp, Turkish, whole nuts. Oh my gosh. You're lying. This is so amazing. Well, thank you so much. I'm super excited because I love trying different foods. I'm sorry. I hate that my straps show because I kind of like want it to be like this. It looks cute when I'm standing up. Oh my gosh, I'm super excited. I love the packaging of these two. It's like a matte, like purple. Thank you so much. It said Gavin Curtis on there, so thank you so much, Gavin Curtis. I am super excited. Letitia Price to Miss Chloe. Yes, ma'am. M-I-S-S, -S, cause we ain't married over this way. <laughs> oh no. I just, I just gave myself a paper cut. Girl, you a whole clown. Oh my goodness, I'm super excited. She sent like dry nail polish. I think they're like the dry nail polish strips. Yeah, they're like dry. Oh my gosh, that's super cool. One of my church friends, she was telling me about it and she was like, it's super easy, like it's super cool. That is super exciting. Thank you so much, Letitia. Thank you so much. Y'all know I'm into nail care. I don't really be going to get my nails done. I'm not saying that I'm never gonna get my nails done. All right, so this package actually did not have a name on it, but I believe, yes, yeah, she sent me something before. Lavish Butters, yes. I have gotten a package from her before, absolutely. Okay, so Lavish Butters. I'm gonna go ahead and link her down in the description down below. She sent me two body scrubs, foaming body scrubs. Okay, I got me a peppermint foaming body scrub and a strawberry a uh, foaming body scrub oh my gosh i'm super excited and the packaging is just super adorable it's like an ombre with the peppermint i love that thank you so much i'm gonna go ahead and link her um website down in the description super grateful y'all know i love my body scrubs and i just feel like okay so i like tree hut but i kind of feel like it might be causing body acne on my arms so i'm like i gotta start trying like different body scrubs that are like you know good and i feel like since her stuff is homemade, it's definitely going to be like better ingredients. So I'm super excited about that. Kiana. I love that name. Okay, so Kiana Caesar. Wait a dang minute. Girl, you have a book. Call to be chosen, not punished. Okay. This is so cool because it's like I have a book for my subscriber with her face on it. That's like... Wow, let me read her letter though. I love hearing you guys' testimony and I'm just so grateful for all of the support that I received from you guys. And it's just amazing, like, it's like real people out here that really support me like family. This one is from Alma, Alma Williams. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's, it's packaged so cute. What is this? What is this, girl? Look at all the gold and pink. I believe this is like the products that she's sending me from her business, Glass Skin Elixir. Oh, look at this from her webs. I'm gonna go ahead and link her website down in the description down below. Oh my gosh, she sent me press on nails. I love the short ones when I get them from like Target and stuff like that. Super cute. I love the color choice. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. This is also from her line, Body Nectar. It's a luxurious, all natural whipped body butter. Oh my goodness. I love the packaging. It smells like cocoa butter. 
It smells really nice and like chocolatey and smooth. I like that. Okay, got me a body nectar. Glass skin magic cleansing and moisturizing oil. Remember you are worth the best. Use this oil to remove makeup or moisturize your beautiful skin. Also great for clearing blemishes and keeping your skin young and supple. Glass skin magic cleansing and moisturizing oil. Y'all know I'm trying to reach that glass skin. Okay, I'm trying to get glass skin one day. Okay, so thank you. Oh, this is super cool. It's a skin healer. Like, you can, like, soothe your skin with it and, like, spray your skin with it. That's exciting. Wait a minute. Her business cards are, like, literally as hard as a credit card. That is high quality. Her and her mom created this skincare line. Oh, my gosh. I love that because I love seeing daughters and moms because my mom and I are so close. Thank you so much for thinking about me. She bought nails last night and wanted to get me some, too. Like, how? Why are you thinking about me? Like, you guys are just the best. Like, I don't understand, like, why you guys are so nice more nails thank you look how cute all right so this is actually the last package <laughs> okay lip glosses lip glosses when y'all be sending me like chapsticks and lip glosses who was this from i'm so sorry i just ripped it right open hold on leah wilson girl thank you and let me tell y'all hold on hold on i'm gonna go ahead and link her etsy down below be bougie by wilson here is the mango like um chapstick and then a sweet pea lip gloss sweet pea definitely one of my favorite scents ever in the world so i'm super grateful thank you guys so much and we're gonna, we're gonna go on with the rest of our day but thank you every single one of you guys that sent me something it really means a lot to me and i'm just kind of like whoa taken aback by this so it's on yeah it's on what's good it's your boy oh, Kid Kid no. Kid Kid. In the cut, you know, I'm driving past the side, you know, got the cane with You show your here. cane? You know, yeah, they got them seats, so look at you people see what's up, you know what I'm saying? Hey, look, y'all, we had it the best boy! You know what I'm saying? We're gonna get hold it down with the GoPro, see what's yeah, going on. Yeah, from Miami! Uh, see if GoPro can really handle the quality we trying to accomplish. Right, today, you know? right. They should have, like, the new, new one. I don't really keep up with GoPros, but we gotta figure out what they... Yeah, I don't really keep up with them But we gonna find out. We gonna find out! We gonna let the Holy Spirit guide us. And Amen! Figure it out. Yeah! <laughs> That's how we do it. <laughs> like, that the Holy Spirit got us, we start praying in the cane, just like, went towards hey, it. Look, hey, look, look, at, <laughs> hey, look, you never know. Look at, you don't never know. Wait, what, what do you do with uh, Moses and the staff? You never know. This might, you never know. This might turn Let into. Let him know. You do not know what this might turn into. I knew it was meant for me to have it, but you never know what God might use it. God Yo. Might use it. Yeah, I mean. So. That's crazy. Do you walk with the cane or do you just hold it? I kind of just hold it like, so like, like this, or like this, depending on what side I'm on, or like I hold it across my arm like the this. The little sparkles don't come off at all? No, no. This lady made it customized what? in the UK. She made like there's not another one like this one. There's Come not. Come on, dude, go. There's not another one in the world like this. And like she made some custom. She customized. Wow, them. really? Yeah. I, the purple theme was my theme for the album, and then all of a sudden I wanted a cane. I, God, I'm telling you, God led me to this one right here. <laughs> and like it was, it was only purple one. It was. It was perfect. You know. Oh, you was, did want? You wanted purple? I wanted purple. I knew I wanted purple. So it worked out in my favor. God was good. Like nice. That. Yeah, so, so. Nice. But yeah, you know, we ain't nothing to turn up. We gonna go in here and shut it down, you know what I'm saying? Shut it down? Yeah, I'm trying not to be too much, because they might try to kick brother out, but you know what I'm saying? This dude. That's how it is. So it's gonna be smooth, you know what I'm saying? We coming at y'all live and direct. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna look in the camera. I don't know if we do that here. You said what? what? We look in the camera in this? Yeah, oh, I yeah. mean, when I'm driving, it's like, I look here and there, but I, be, I don't look in the viewfinder. I mean, I look in the, wait, what? In the camera? The yeah. Camera, the lens? Oh, so I ain't driving, I so really I can look all up in it. Yeah, exactly. Broski, best boy. I hate What's best boy. Down? I mean, I don't hate best boy. I love it. But every single time I come in here, I need something important. So you come in, you have to take a chunk out of your bank account. Oh yeah, every time. Yeah, ain't nothing under a hundred dollars up in here. I know it's all crazy right. out here. Mm -mm, yeah, Dang. All right, we're about to go in the best boy. What the junk? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what is the biggest difference between this eight and this max here? Well, the difference between eight and the max, or yeah. nine and the max, or this. So the nine I see is waterproof. Is there? Is that? Oh, they're all waterproof. They're all. Oh, they waterproof. are waterproof. So what's the difference between the nine and the max? Well, the biggest difference with the max is that the max is a 360 degree camera, so it's got oh. two cameras on both sides, oh. so it records in a 360 oh. degrees. Oh, okay. The other, you know, nine, eight, seven, all the way back to the one doesn't record in 360 it's okay. it's you know basically with the, the the seven black they introduce what they call hyper smooth image stabilization so again they're all waterproof up to 33 feet they both all of them have voice recognition you can tell it to start stop recording with the black they introduce the hyper smooth image stabilization so it means that if you are shaking you know you got your, you've got your GoPro in the car and you're hitting those bumps or whatever and just you know you're shaking 
your video is not going to shake as much. Right. So with the eight, you know, now they went to 2.0. Nine, they went to the 3.0. So there's a few other little factors, but other than that, that's really the biggest difference. Okay, so we are in Best Buy. Wow, the lighting in Best Buy is nice, bro. You missing out, broski. Oh, what's up? What's up, people out there? Hollywood. 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 What the junk is going on? <laughs> so we're looking at some of the materials right now. We're trying to figure out what we got going on because the whole purpose of us getting this GoPro is like for like the Miami trip. But then afterwards, obviously, is good use. So we're looking at the GoPro like stuff right now. Yeah. So I, I don't know. My thing is, I see. I'm, what we're, I think one number one we're trying to figure out is how much stuff we need. What exactly that? Do exactly. We need? Personally, I definitely think the one we're getting. I think that one is good. Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to figure out how. 360 one. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just trying to figure out how necessary all this stuff really truly is. Right. You know. So I definitely feel like whatever one that's necessary, we definitely need the head strap and the clip. Right. Yeah. I mean, I this think... is my this is my thing. Like this is what that we have to figure out is because yeah, you do it yourself, so you are gonna need stuff for after. That's what but I'm just thinking. Just for Miami. Just for Miami. What are we gonna need? Really need that much. Not stuff. not nothing much at all. But you're definitely gonna need a headpiece and a, and a vlogging Absolutely. stick. Absolutely. So that's just basically it. That's basically it. So yeah, head strap, quick clip, compact case, the handler. Floating hand grip. Oh my. Girl, you can, you, you can do whatever you want to in this world. Don't let nobody try to steal your shine and tell you you cannot. You can. You can. You can. This is stemming can. from me taking the camera down. Yeah, because she don't got to take the camera down. That's what she does. You know what I'm saying? People <laughs> shut up. No, that's what she is. what she does. Now we're here in the mall. I got to look for like some dude swim trunks from Miami. We're going to be on the beach, right? Because I got to have the right swim trunks. Swim style. Look at these are nice right here. Yeah, these are nice, man. These are real nice. Get like a basic top to go with them. I wish they had extra small. They usually do. In men's? Yeah. I don't think men's carries actually. Yes, small. they do. Probably not no more then. Yes, they here especially. Really? Probably just not not in these. Somebody probably already got them. I'll, I'll be wear, in here. Like a regular like swimsuit underneath it just in case it like tries to fall down. Cause you know in water everything's get everything get loose. Right. So yeah, these are really nice. I think these are nice too. Oh, extra small. See? See, these are extra small. Okay. So then that means I can't get nothing small. <laughs> you need help. <laughs> <laughs> No, broski. All right, I got two extra small swimwears for the beach. Look at these nice sunglasses, man. <laughs> it's crispy, broski. Well, that's really all I came in here for. I don't really know what else I would even try to look for. So what are you going to wear with that then if you're going to get that? A swimsuit top. Okay. Exactly. Hi, HM. Well, you don't want so much you want it, so I'm just saying I'm trying to help you. Oh. Oh, calm down. Are you got me on there? Yeah, just try to pull out like here. Crispy broski. Oh, dang. The homie. You know, God is good. Amen, amen. Okay, so y'all know, if you watched my recent video, I was going to pick this up in my recent video. I thought it was really cute, but I just did not know what to match it up with. But now they have these shorts right here that are really dope, and they're morally, like, loose, so I like that. So, I think I'm going to go ahead and grab this top. Sometimes I'm in a two, sometimes I'm in a four. Since this is a tight top, I don't want it to be too loose around my waist, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab the two. And I think that'll be a cute outfit together with this bag. Oh, crap. Yeah, that's nice. Nice little bag. Man, I become an Asian for like all my clothing nowadays. So like, it used to be Target. I still mess with Target, but their pieces are not as me anymore. My brother and I were just talking about how my, my style is different all the time. Well, these are some nice jeans. But I don't like, I don't like jeans that have like patches right there. I like them to be like, if they're gonna have holes, let them have holes in them. This is a two. Ain't these nice? They might be a little long though. I yeah. like them, they look, they look they're a little so long though. Long. Definitely long. But, some, but you know what, they might be actually meant to drag a little bit, like when you like wear heels and stuff. But they get dirty, I don't even they get They definitely get dirty, yeah. Man, I had wore some, I was outside the other day and I had wore some bell bottoms. The bottom of them were so brown by the end of the night. I wish they had skirts like this, just like a little bit longer. Yeah, stuff ain't really getting longer these days. I know, I know, man. This is a nice shirt, ain't it? I don't know what hey, I wear. It's cool. It's straight. Hey, you know. I know how to dress. Yeah, but that ain't what you asked me. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't what you asked me. I know how to put it together. Yeah, you. you what you asked me if it was a nice shirt. person with good style can make a shirt that's not so nice make it look nice. Sick him, sick him. <laughs> you know what? Hey, you no. know what you did in your video the other day you should do more of? What? Do your little dances. No, that's embarrassing, bro. No, you did. You killed it. No, I can't first. dance. You no, know, you did the. Oh, no. I can't. Kill like, it. Probably, the real New Yorkers probably tease me for no, doing you that killed dance. It. I watch, I've been there. I know how it goes. Uh, I was there when they first came out with I'm it. I'm not going to dance, bro. I'm I, look, I look so stupid. Nah, hey, I but I'll tell you my good move, though. I'll show you my good move. What? That's my good move. The little set. <laughs> <laughs> not funny, don't say hey, little. Do it, do it again, do it again. No, no. Hold on, get the feet in it, get the feet. Hey. Do one of my sketches, bro. Hey, uh-oh. <laughs> hey, shout out hey, to bro, the sketch, bro. Hey, bro, I rock different, man. 
schedule, bro. Rock them on. Let them know what to you do. Know, you know how it goes. You know, let it shine. You know how it goes. Everybody wants the Air Forces, but I want the Skechers. Everybody ain't glow yet. <laughs> Simple. Man, these pins are so nice. It's making me mad. You go try to fold them up. <laughs> <laughs> if I had like a tailor, that would be good. I told my mom I had to have you dress me one day. Look it, I'm always down for it. Char, man, char. Hey, man, you know it. Yeah, but I don't know. I don't think you can dress too well. Please. <laughs> I'm just playing. Please. That's why we need a 360 camera, because I want to get your reaction. <laughs> right, eyebrows folding up. Okay. I'm just playing. No, that, that's what I, you know what I was thinking about? That uh, Go, that GoPro is dope for that, though. It can switch back and forth a little. Ain't that crazy? So you can start using that. That is real. I just got to figure out how all of it comes together to work. All right, so I need to go ahead and get all of like this bag packed up. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I have so far. So I have the dress that I showed you guys in my recent video. I have the outfit that I showed you guys. I tried these on for you guys in my recent video. I have those new pajamas that I got from Victoria's Secret. So basically, I am making like a checklist. So I have like everything that I need to take right here. I have the lotion that I'm going to be using on the trip. This Bomb Dia Bright Cream. They're new Sol Janeiro or whatever. So basically, I have two outfits. I need one more outfit, but I know what outfit I'm going to wear. I'm just going to wear this romper looking thing. It's like a romper. It's like a full like romper looking cute little outfit. So I'm going to go ahead and pack that as my third outfit. So now all of my outfits are done. So now that's checked off. I don't need to bring any more outfits. I have my curl cream. I have my shampoo and conditioner because I want to wash my hair when I get there. And then I have like my bronzing oil to like look all shiny and cute i think the one thing that's gonna be hard for me is picking out one perfume to take because because i can only take one scent i don't want to have to like pack like a bunch of different stuff i'm gonna be taking bar soap and not body wash body wash is too heavy and bar soap is just super classic super easy so what i'm gonna go ahead and do is now i'm gonna go ahead and pick out my perfume grab my bar soaps and my washcloths i have to have a washcloth and a baby washcloth so i gotta go ahead and get that all packed up if i had to like pick one scent to wear i would have to choose this versace bright crystal but i only have this bottle and it's way 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 too big so I don't think I'm gonna go ahead and take that. I think, if anything, I'm probably gonna go with this balance. Matter of fact, no, I know exactly what I wanna wear. I know exactly which one. It's actually gonna be the exact perfume that I wore today, the Versace Ejos. This right here is the best ever. Definitely gonna take this. That should be enough for the trip, but it also might not be enough. Like, is that even enough? I don't really know, but I know that I do want this perfume. This perfume smells the best ever. So for the bar soap for my body, I'm going to go ahead and use the Dove Gentle Exfoliating. And then I need to go ahead and find like an unscented Dove bar soap for like, you know, the lady bits. Okay, so I need to go ahead and like organize all of this. But I have my Versace Ejos. I have my bar soap that I'm going to be using to clean my body. And then I'm also going to go ahead and put one of these Dove Sensitive Skin bars in here. You already know. Let me go grab my washcloth and my baby washcloth. Okay, so I keep all my washcloths in this closet in my hallway. So I'm going to go ahead and grab a is this a gray yep gray washcloth and then a baby washcloth a pink baby washcloth that actually i'm gonna go ahead and grab the all pink okay so i have these two washcloths that i'm gonna that i'm gonna go ahead and use on the trip okay so i have the bar soap the washcloth the baby washcloth the perfume i only have two outfits no i have the three out outfits i have the three outfits i have the shampoo and conditioner um what else do i have in there curl cream i have in there lotion and my oil bronzer the night before matter of fact i'm gonna go ahead and write a note for myself the night before i take off i need to make sure i have all of my skincare stuff in this bag because my skincare honestly is super 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 important i'm gonna go ahead and grab some lady products grab a few of these and then grab a few of these just to be safe i'm gonna go ahead and put some flushable wipes in there definitely gonna need those cannot go without those wipe that tush staying fresh okay i'm not gonna need five pair of underwear but i'm definitely going to take five pair of underwear just in case you never know five perfect now we have five pair of underwear we're definitely gonna need you just never know you want to pack things that are really really important two sports bras i know exactly which ones i want to take so i just ordered these off of amazon they're super cute and super comfortable i just ordered these super cute like lace type of sports bras from amazon love these they're super oh i just i just love them so i'm gonna go ahead and pack those two now i have my two sports bras my five underwear i need my swimsuits okay so basically i have like a swimsuit idea i'm about to go ahead and try these swimsuits on for you guys okay so the thing with this is i do not know how much this is going to cover up like i just do not know like i think it's really cute blah 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 cute from miami pretty classy this right here i don't know how much this is going to cover up like if i'm swimming or something like that so this is just, just gonna have to be like for like the beach like just to like be cute or like just like swayed in the water because this is not going to cover up much it's not much support so i am kind of like a little bit nervous about it because i don't really know how to feel about it because i'm like should i have gotten this dang swimsuit like i don't know i don't like how wide it makes my stomach look you know but hey i mean it's cute i'm gonna go ahead and pack it just in case i think i have another swimsuit that i can pack but i'm about to go ahead and try on this other swimsuit for you guys okay so this is the second swimsuit you know you know i think it's pretty cute 
because I still want to get like tan lines, but I also just don't know really how, I don't know how to feel about this because I don't really wear two pieces. I don't know how to feel. I think they're cute. I think like the outfit is like cute. I think like the shorts are like honestly perfect, but I just do not know how to feel about the two piece. I do have some suits. It's just most of them do not support anything. I feel like this one might be more supportive than the rest of the ones that I have. But just give me a second. I'm trying to figure everything out. Okay, so for pajamas, I already have one set of pajamas in there. The next set of pajamas is going to be just a regular pair of gray sweatpants. And then this type of cami that I have on today, just in like a different print. Now I just need one more pair of pajamas, which should be super easy to find. It shouldn't be anything. Okay. Pajama pants right there. And then a tank top. I just bought some tank tops today. Where did I put them? Right here. Extra small tank top. I can go ahead and wear with those. So now my pajamas are done. Um, next is going to be deodorant. Let me grab a deodorant stick. All right. Got some deodorant. And then I'm going to have to pack like my toothpaste and my toothbrush the day before. Actually, I found some toothbrushes and I found a new tube of toothpaste. I'm just going to go ahead and throw that in there and then throw like a new toothbrush in there really quickly. So got to have like my, you know, intimate shaving stuff, my, you know, all my intimate shaving stuff. My Venus pubic hair razor, just changed the razor head on that. And then, did I just change the razor head on this? I don't know if I just, no, I didn't. I have to go ahead and change the razor head on my leg and like armpit razor. And then I'm gonna go ahead and pack that as well. So I have my toothbrush, my toothpaste. I'm gonna have to, I'm, I'm gonna have to go ahead and pack my tongue brush right before I leave. Pillowcases, I have to have pillowcases in here. My new jewelry, let me see. I have some hair perfume. I have some charm bracelets from the beauty supply store. An anklet, gotta have my anklet. Like my actual tripod, this actual tripod needs to go in there. And then pillowcases and then I should be good. And then the night before I'll go ahead and put in all my skincare. Okay, so I got my two pillowcases because I have acne, I cannot take the chance of my face breaking out because of their pillowcases. Like, I don't care if they bleach them, whatever they do. They're still, mm, mm somebody else's bacteria. So, basically, I have, like, this Target bag. I should probably use a Ziploc bag, but I'm gonna go ahead and put, like, all, like, the little necessities in here. So, like, I have my razor and then my razor refill. I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there. I'm gonna put my deodorant and then, like, all, like, the little necessities. Like, all, like, the little hygiene products that I showed you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and put them in this little bag just in case. So, I have, like, my razors and stuff. All of that can go in there. This toothbrush... Honestly, it probably shouldn't go in here, but it's gonna go in here. And then that should be good for like the, like the little necessities that I have. I guess my little anklet can go in there as well. And then my little charm bracelets are already in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there and lay it flat. All right, so I have my new bottle of Azo Cranberry Probiotics, whatever they call these, I don't really know. I'm just gonna pour some in the bag. Pour a good amount so that, you know, I'm not like low on anything. I'll just pour like a good amount in there. And then I'll just pour some chlorophyll in there. And then some Azos, some of those in there. And that's honestly all I take. I used to take way more, but I'm just like, these are the ones that really work and that I found work pretty good. So I'm just going to go ahead and put those in there and I should be good. And now all I need to pack is like my skincare. Overall, everything is packed, sis. Overall, everything in there is what I need. I shouldn't need anything else. I'm honestly like an overpacker, so I'm hoping that I'm not like overdoing anything, but I think this is exactly what I need. These nails are like really cute. I really like them, but I have to go ahead and end off this video. Y'all. I just had to make a second trip to Best Buy. I hope the quality is not too bad because I'm filming on my phone right now because my camera died. Second trip to Best Buy because I bought the wrong mic. I bought a GoPro Max and I bought a GoPro 9 mic. I'm looking at the GoPro and I'm looking at the case and I'm like, this case for this microphone, this looks like a whole different, my brother was like, you bought a Max, you didn't buy a 9. And I'm like, oh my gosh, like what was I thinking? Definitely a test because I had to stay patient. And my family was like, you're going right now? Like, I'm like, yes, because if I don't get up and take this this mic back right now, I'm never going to take it back. So I'm not wasting 80 something dollars. I'm mad that they couldn't give it back to me in cash because I had to wait for it to get back on my card. But yeah, and I was like, oh my gosh. So basically, definitely a test to, definitely a test to patience because girl, the Lord be having to work with us. You know, he will give us something to, to teach us and to also work with us. I got to use my hands to hold my phone real quick because I don't want my phone coming off. I mean falling so basically right now i'm just gonna go ahead and head home i have a pair of pressed on nails in my mailbox and i'm super excited to go ahead and see what they look like and then after i get done showing you guys those i guess i'll go ahead and end up the video because i was gonna end up the video anyway but it was just like a test of faith i mean test of patience uh, baby look i appreciate the lord and i know he be doing stuff to work with me and if he's not working with me and giving me you know a little test i'd be wondering like am i doing something like am i even like worth working with right now like like what's going on you know so my mom even said something the other day and it's very true and I kind of want to touch on it so she basically said you could be going through so much um sir why are you stopping 
the speed limit is 45 and you're going 25 let me go around you broski i will quickly go around somebody i'm sorry like i'm a really good driver but like if you're going that slow like that's not gonna work so anyway what was i gonna say oh my mom was like basically like you could be going through so much that it feels like is god even does god even love me anymore like is god even here for me anymore like is jesus here like i am like going through so much like i just feel so depressed like i feel like there's nothing to live for and there is so much to live for like the devil is such a deceiver you can look around and be like okay i got this to live for i got this to do i got this to do and then he'd be like nah you ain't nothing like you definitely ain't got nothing to live for excuse you excuse the heck out of me and it's basically just like when you're taking the test is the teacher not silent okay it's all a test and tests only bring us higher once you pass that test you go into a higher level because let me tell you something once you pass a grade in school, don't you go to a higher grade? So it's all about us passing these tests and going up to another level. But isn't the teacher silent while you're taking a test? Hmm. The Lord is watching you. He's got you. He's behind you, in front of you, beside you, on both sides. He's surrounding you with his holy blood and his holy angels and his holy spirit. With that being said, we got to stay strong in faith and know that the Lord Jesus Christ is with me. We got to give him his time. Because how can you say that you love somebody how can I tell, I don't have kids, but how can I tell my kids I love you? I'm never gonna spend time with you. I'm never gonna even take the initiative to take out time with you. Can't tell somebody you love them and you are nowhere to be found. And I'm literally saying that in the most non-judgmental way possible because baby, while I'm preaching to you, I'm preaching to myself, okay? We all struggle with getting up trying to read that Bible and praise and worshiping and praying and staying steadfast, staying 10 toes down with the Lord Jesus Christ. Don't we all struggle with that? Because baby, it ain't easy. Anyway, I'm about to go ahead and pull up to my mailbox and I'm about to go ahead and get these press-on nails at the mailbox because baby, I'm excited. <laughs> I love my press-on nails, girl. Yes, we keeping them cute. Okay. Yo, we out here playing, what is this game called? Call of Duty, Call of Black Ops 4. Black Ops 4. And yeah, put the camera on your head so you're gaming, you can see it like that. Yup. What, 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 nice. what is it called? What is it called? The Crip Walk? Yeah, yeah. Hey, look at <laughs> Hit that boy. What's up? <laughs> hey, y'all. Hey, hey, be a better yeah. gamer. Oh! Chris Brown in this mug! Hey, oh! Hey, 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 hey. Use Claw to be a better gamer. <laughs> Brandon Boo, you're messing up his dance. <laughs> Hit it for him one time. You ever see? Brandon, you ever see that video where that girl was like, they was like, Jada, Icky Butchy, yeah. you live and direct no, no disrespect really like say bless why am i a guy on here well, you could have been a girl but too bad <laughs> what kind of sense does that make the game started what's wrong with you guys Brent, we're always waiting for Brent for the games you mean it's loading you know how it works there it's like Brent's brain just loading Wow, why is it's like your head just loading? <laughs> Test your mouth. You, you look like a melon ball. You look like a melon bar. You look like Lamello. Lamello? Yeah. Lamello. You, that, that's really offensive, bro. Ah. But hey, he's fly, bro. Yeah, he got Puma. That don't mean nothing. I see what you're saying with the quality. I better be bottom shit. You see what I'm saying? Look at all these dead zombies. Look at all these dead zombies. Look at all these dead zombies. I'm talking about the man in the mirror. Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me. Oh, oh, get away from me. Help me, help me, you guys are whack. You guys don't even have my back like that. Oh, you got it. Get away from me. No. No. Rhymes and shine. Not as good quality as my camera, but hey, oh, my mom's back there. I'm, I'm, try, I'm trying not to show her over there. She's not really dressed. She's been taking care of the baby all night. Look at this dude over here recording on his phone. <laughs> hey, exactly. Hey. For real? Oh, my bad. What'd you say? What'd you say? <laughs> I was talking to your squad through my camera. What's your squad, squad name is? Oh, so you already know what it is. I don't even know yet. The Painters. I'm just playing. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. Bro, that's cringe. Bro, Yo, look at these nails I just got. Y'all, these, these joints go hard, bro. The shape is perfect. It's not too square. It's like, I mean, it's not too coffin and like, it's like tapered square. It's really dope. God bless you all. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'm excited about my new nails. Okay. And it's time for you to go ahead and head up all the huge big dog. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>